the Aka Greater Brockton is a very positive, uplifting place. No matter why you come into our building, you're guaranteed to leave with a smile and say, boy, that made my day, I'm glad I came here. Our primary mission, as you know, is to help individuals of all ages and all abilities that have various intellectual and developmental disabilities and autism spectrum disorders. We have such a range of different activities and programs and services and resources uh, that we provide. Whether someone wants to have fun, build relationships, develop uh, supports, work on certain skill development needs that they have, or looking just for a place to come and enjoy the day with others. And um, we have that here at the Aka Greater Brockton. They are a group of very caring individuals. As a parent, um, it's very comforting to know that you're leaving your child in such good hands. We're just so over the moon happy here because we feel he is so safe. The best part about the ARC is that I have you guys and you guys are here to help us when we need help or you guys are sometimes funny or even generous and kind. It really grows my heart because the act of kindness is what we need in this ARC to have like a safe environment. We have a large uh, part-time support team that is out in the community every day. We serve 11 communities and we service three to 400 families. Wherever they need us to be, we'll go to them and, and provide them that support, whether it's helping them through an arduous process with the state for certain benefits that they may need, providing more adaptive technology or resources within their homes, or working to help them uh, develop those relationships and just companionship. When he was little, he was traumatized to the point where he could not leave the house. So the ARC came to me. The Family Support Center came to me. They would come out once a week. They would, all the workshops that they offer and whatnot, they would bring it to me after. And they would sit and educate me so that I could be the best advocate for him. The support is tremendous on that. As a parent, you're always feeling like you're sitting on one side of the table and everyone else is on the other side. They're sitting there with you. We do have workforce opportunities within our organization. We have a bottle and can redemption center. It's a great employment opportunity for the participants that are here, whether it's sorting cans, counting, sorting bottles, doing the cash exchange, working the register, you know, there's a lot of different skill sets that are earned. And what's nice about it is it's right here in our facilities. Why do you like working with the Redemption Center so much? I like to, I like to make money. What do you do for work here? Uh, sort cans, erupt skids. Those that want to work for an hour, they'll come up and enter Redemption and we'll put them to work for an hour and then they can go back and do their community activity. Having it in-house gives participants a lot of flexibility to, uh, to work. Complementing with our lawn care company that goes out and does lawns throughout the community, residences in our, in our region. And it's a great business for us, but it, most importantly, like the Redemption Center, it's a great employment opportunity that we provide to participants. It's just a really nice place to be. They try to get you jobs, so after you go to school, they just try to get you a job out of the community. I'm actually working Sunday at The Rocks showing people where their seats are. We do a, a work relationship with the Brockton Rocks every summer. So we bring about 20 participants over there at their games to provide employment opportunities. And it's such a camaraderie that is formed with those participants that are going there together and it, it forms that bond. The reason people leave here with a smile and I leave here with a smile is for the spontaneous things that happen throughout the day where Participants can go up and uh, play a song and, and take advantage of the stage. They can reach out to a physical trainer we have here on staff and go into the exercise room. In our cooking classes, we invite participants to tell us what they want to cook and we're trying to incorporate healthy eating uh, to match with our physical health and wellness program. It's all of supporting that goodwill in that appreciation we get from participants and seeing the joy that it brings in them and the joy that gives to all of us that work here, you can't help but be inspired, you know, every day. Every family has a choice on where they want to bring their loved one 
to provide resources and services or where they want to have their loved one be during the day. And I assure you that uh, when somebody comes here, they're going to have a good feeling. That energy and that opportunity happens here every day. And I, I think if you're a family looking for a choice and looking for a good place for your loved one to be in a safe place and in a place that's going to help that person grow, you know, we're, we're that spot for you.